Hello, thank you so much for coming back and watching today's video. It is on my favorite hair accessories for summer. So if you'd like to see my favorite hair accessories and show how I use them, then please keep on watching. Also make sure that you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell, bookmark my page. I upload a video every single day of the week, plus I also do live streams every Sunday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I would love for you to be able to come on back and watch whenever you would like. So, I love wearing my hair up, especially during the summer. I just took my hair down, that's why it's looking a little crazy, but I want to share with you my favorite hair accessories. So, all these are super affordable and easy to find, and I will link them down below. It will be an Amazon affiliate link, so if you do use it, I'd get a small little bit of commission, but by no means you don't have to. Okay, so the very first thing is this alligator clip. So. This thing is amazing. When my hair was long, I could still use this, okay? So, what's really, really nice is that if you have a hard time with dexterity or anything like that, this is gonna be for you. Very, very easy to open up, okay? And it just slides right back, okay? And it secures the hair very, very nicely, okay? I personally would go ahead and use a few bobby pins to um, pin up the little back pieces but it's very very secure doesn't hurt the head doesn't pull the hair and yeah I really really love this thing you can do a lot of different styles with it um, if you do have shorter hair like I do you know it still works um, yeah they're just great they're really really affordable I think I got this at like Walmart for less than two bucks I know that they do have these at the dollar store from time to time so it's just a big alligator clip and you wouldn't think it would hold so well but the thing is, there's these little spiky teeth, okay? And then when you close it, it's sitting between your hair and the clamp. So, really, really nice. I mean, watch this. Look at that, okay? So, I don't have a ton of hair there, okay? But it's very, very secure, very, very comfortable, and it will hold, I'd say, most weights of hair. If you obviously have very, very thick, very, very thick, heavy hair, you might need to use like a rubber band or something before you use this, but these are awesome and I absolutely love it. So, and uh, I used to have a brown one and I lost it, so I guard this black one with like my soul because I don't want to lose it because I love it that much. So, big giant alligator clips are amazing. Next thing I'm gonna go ahead and show you is the little corkscrew spiral pins. I know that these were popular a couple years ago. Um, I did jump on that bandwagon a little bit late. I've had these for probably about a year and a half, almost two years now, and it's just a cute little corkscrew pin. What's really, really nice is that it very securely holds the hair. So I'll show you. So let's just pretend this was my, like the back of my head and I'm doing a bun, okay? How these work, okay, is you actually kind of screw them into the style, okay? So that's just one, okay? Very, very secure, very, very comfortable, and you don't have 50 billion pins. Um, I love bobby pins, and I will use them, and they're easy and they're cheap, um, but they get lost very, very easily, and I don't like that. So I'm just gonna show you really quick. Okay, so if I was doing a super high bun or something, okay, so. There we go. Um, what I like about the little corkscrew pins too is that they're a lot more gentle on the hair. I think we've all have experienced when you um, have like this old ratty um, bobby pin and it's like missing the little rubber coating on the tip and it scratches your scalp. No, just me? Okay. Anyway, um, these are really, really gentle on the hair and scalp. And I just really, really love these. And I still have one left I didn't even have to use. Once again, I do have layered hair, so I would use like just regular bobby pins to pin it up. But I do love these corkscrew pins. They are amazing and really, really affordable. I think I got a three pack for like 250 and that was years ago. So them not being popular anymore, I bet you could get these for even cheaper. They have the short length, which is this. And then I do have some longer ones. I couldn't find them though. But with my hair length right now, um, the short ones do work just perfect in my hair. So the corkscrew pins are a definite must have if you do like to wear your hair up a lot. And once again, super, super gentle. Also trying to be more gentle with my hair since I do have hair fallout. Um, so sometimes pulling out 
just regular bobby pins. It's too much and I end up ripping out hair and I don't want to rip out hair. So, okay, so the last one, they're kind of the same product that's just different sizes. So it is just a regular claw clip. So right here I have just like a little tiny baby one. It's not the most smallest ones that you can get, but it's a pretty small size. I love to use the smallest size if I'm just wanting to throw the front top portion of my hair up, okay? So once again, I got this at my local Dollar Tree and I think I got like 10 of them for a buck. Look how easy and fast that was. Like no time at all. Once again though, it kind of makes it look like you spent a little bit more time and effort into your hair when really you did not. This is just as easy as throwing your hair up in a ponytail, putting on a baseball cap, or doing nothing with your hair, but it just looks a little bit nicer. So love the little tiny baby ones for throwing up the top portion, or even if you like to like kind of do like the kind of rolled up sides. Once again, if bobby pins are a little hard for you to use because you have dexterity issues with your fingers, you can totally just do that really really beautiful and uh, very very simple and yeah I really really love these things so versatile really can't go wrong with a little baby claw clip great okay and then the larger claw clip love these so much um, I like the decorative ones I think they just look really really pretty in the hair once again super fast super easy I mean honestly if it wasn't fast and easy I wouldn't do it I'm I'm not very good at doing hair. I'm not. Um, but with this, you can just get a really, really pulled together look. It gets the hair off the back of your neck and out of your face. Um, you can definitely make it more neat. I could tuck in the ends and kind of do kind of like a faux French twist. Um, I could poof up the top a little bit. But it's just really fast, really easy. And it's just a little bit more classy looking than a regular ponytail. I still will rock the ponytail. Love the ponytail, but if I just want something a little bit more extra, I'll throw in the claw clip. Um, I got this in a two pack, so I got a black one and then the tortoise shell at my local Dollar Tree for a buck. So you don't need to spend a whole bunch of money on hair accessories. You can definitely find very good affordable ones, whether it's Walmart, your dollar store, wherever, but they're great. And you know, if they do break, they weren't very expensive, but I do love these. Um, and you want to get ones with like the thicker teeth so that way they don't break as easily because I think we've all been there using a claw clip and the ones with the really spindly little teeth like kind of like this one like these break very very easily so thicker ones they do last longer so it's good to go but those are my favorite hair accessories especially for summertime when I want to get my hair out of my face off the back of my neck but I'm tired of just doing the same old ponytail really really great love them all. If I had to choose one, I honestly couldn't. I love them. I love them all. Um, I love the alligator clip, but I love, I love all of them. They're just amazing. And sometimes just being able to throw your hair up and it not be a ponytail, it can do a lot. Like for me, if, if I'm, I don't know, if I'm having a rough time or something, a rough week, sometimes just Feeling like I took a little bit of extra something to try to look a little bit more presentable. I don't know. It helps me, but it's just stupid hair. Wear that ponytail, rock it all summer long. I know I did when I had longer hair, so. But there you go. I hope you enjoyed this little bit of a different type of hairstyle video. If you did, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Also, make sure that you share this video. I know it's a stupid video, but... I know there's a lot of people out there that are still intimidated by hair accessories. You know, it's bobby pins and rubber bands, and that's what they do. They're not hard, they're really easy, and you really can't do anything, like, totally wrong unless it's a round brush and you, like, wind it up in your hair. That's wrong, and you're probably going to end up with a really cute shortcut, but anyway, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite hair accessory? Hair bands, barrettes? claw clips let me know down below in the comments i would love to know and don't forget you can always follow me on my other social media twitter facebook instagram it's all a bunch of glam babe and don't go anywhere quite yet i should have a video that should start auto playing here shortly or you can always click on one of the videos popping up around me let's hang out a little bit longer i'll see you in just a sec